people talk about networking, but I never think of it in that way. I just think of it more as a, a chance to step outside of your own organization, your own way of thinking and your own culture. You know, those, those discussions which are informal actually are even more telling and more informative than sometimes the more formal thing. Yeah. An area that we're quite optimistic about in the near future is the role that cities play in advancing democracy. Those in-person meetings do really build momentum and build uh, the kind of bond that's really important for uh, a collective like Cities Alliance to do its work most effectively. What we're talking about right now is how Cities Alliance is changing and where its focus is going and how that aligns with us. You see that we're doing similar things. Now, why waste resources if you, you know, why not work together on these things? The fact that we had uh, a representative from UNOPS there in the room with us uh, really enabled us to uh, address the issue with candor and, um, uh, and, and look at all the implications uh, that affected Cities Alliance. I have to say my highlights from the whole Tunis meeting were the women. We had the mayor of Tunis who came to speak to us as the first woman elected to the role. And then we also went to visit the Femedina project in the Medina of, of Tunis, where we had the opportunity to hear and discuss with three particular women that were involved in the Femedina project. They were extremely inspiring and it really showed with what kind of interlocutor Cities Alliance works and how just encouraging and supporting these women can really make a big difference in the Medina of Tunis and how this can have a wider impact. To be able to talk to the partners and implementers of the initiatives that Cities Alliance has been uh, working towards in Tunis and Tunisia for, uh, for quite some time, it really reflected the kind of value and the kind of impact that Cities Alliance's work can have and is having on the ground. The agenda, specifically the types of topics that we were discussing, were well thought out. There was a, a balance of both formalized discussion, but then also an opportunity to interact. So I, I did appreciate that. And I think other members appreciated that as well. That's a, a, a strong foundation for this relationship. And, and I, see, I see that growing further as our administration continues to want to expand our efforts at providing resources to uh, local audiences. So there's a grown, growing awareness to work with cities, with local governments, with um, the city authorities to be closer to the people and to implement projects that are sustainable and anchored in the city's setup. And this is what Cities Alliance um, is standing for.